Well, I did a thing and I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with y'all. Hey guys, welcome back to, yes, another Dollar Tree haul. My wish list is almost complete besides all of the new fall stuff that's coming out. Um, my wagon, I know that is ridiculous. All of the stuff was not gathered from one Dollar Tree. My sister has my wish list that keeps on growing. So this is this has taken a while to accumulate and I'm finally sitting down to film it for you guys. So in no particular order, all of this stuff is just crazy mess. I took everything out of the wagon and I have it right here. I'm obsessed with like Dollar Tree accounts. So I like look up Dollar Tree accounts on Instagram or you can look up like the hashtag like Dollar Tree finds and you can see all of the amazing new goodies that are out at the Dollar Tree because there is some amazing stuff. Uh, I also like to look at like DollarTree.com. The thing is when you order something online, you have to buy it like in bulk, like a case of like 48. So I haven't done that yet. I have done it in the past. Let's get, let's just get started. So she picked me up a couple of little, um, like doormats this one's in plain black and I thought I could DIY it and then this one was just super cute and it says home with the little house I thought that was adorable um there is another little rug that's on my list and it has like these like little um tassels and it's so cute but I guess I came across it yet but these are super cute. So she got me two of these in black and white. They're pretty cute. And then two in the blue. And I thought that I could put them together. And because I have some like polyfill. I think that's what it's called. Um, I thought I could put it together and like make Max like a little DIY like little doggy bed. So got those as well. Um, some little wood cutouts here. I have two that say home. It's really hard to see. I'm sorry, guys. I have two of these that say home. And then one that says hello. I thought these would be super cute for some DIYs. I'm trying to like upcycle like some of like our recycling, aka like things that you would put in the trash. I've been holding on to some pieces that I want to DIY. So, got some nautical rope. Okay, so these were a new item that were on my list. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Cushion Foundation. When this stuff first came out, I absolutely loved it and had repurchased it. Have not used it in a while. And whenever I saw it on some Dollar Tree accounts that these were popping up at the Dollar Tree, I was like, oh my goodness, I used to love this stuff. I don't remember what shade I was in. So Meg picked me up three, tawny, buff beige, and nude beige. And I figured I could mix and match. Like if I want one was too dark and one was too light, then I could mix them to make my perfect color. For a dollar, you cannot beat this. She also picked me up another pair of the little detailing scissors. Love these so, so much. And then this is new to me. This is a scrap utility knife set. I thought that this would be a fun addition to add to my crafting toolbox. Speaking of which, I got some stencils. So these two right here are different alpha stencils. And then these have little words on them like love, joy, gratitude. I have never tried stencils from the Dollar Tree before. But I thought for some DIYs, this would be pretty fun. Oh, and here is another set of stencils. Now these feel like a lot thicker than this one. So just another set of just like a different font. She did find, I think she found two packs of these. These are the extra sheets, so like the filler paper for their um, version of like the dupe happy planner. You definitely could add these to like a happy notes that you already have or a mini happy planner that you already own. You could use this as filler paper. So, so excited. She still has not been able to find the planners. I want to get my hands on one of the Dollar Tree like happy planner dupe planners. So, so bad. I believe there's two that are out there like one is floral and one has uh, polka dots I want to find one so bad we have some thread and some rulers these are for a crafting project you get two wood rulers for a dollar this here is a little uh, black glass ball 
I thought this would be fun for a little DIY. They also have one of these that's like in creamer white. I'm not sure if you can see in here, but this is a little decor piece that I bought at Hobby Lobby. And they're like exactly the same thing. And Dollar Tree has one that looks like it's similar to this. So I got this. Here is a candle holder and a little vase. This, I believe, came in a few colors. I've seen it in like pink and gray. So Meg found me a little white one. Such a cute little unique shape. We have some more like little decor items here. Uh-oh. We have these little balls. Um, I got her to pick me up some of these, what are they called? Burner cover sets. You get, you get a two piece. The packaging is already coming open. So you get this size and a smaller one. This is for a DIY. Okay, yeah, here is the other little set of the notebook papers. And then some little list pads because I am obsessed with little list pads. And these are absolutely adorable. Uh, this one says farmer's market, farm to table, and need to get. So I had books on my list. All I needed were two books that were basically the same, same size, so that I could use them for a DIY. So that's what these two are for. So these two are the exact same books for a DIY. And then she said there was this amazing display of books. So I just had her pick out a few. This one is called Christmas in Paris. So ah, I just, I love a good Christmas book. And then this one, the cover is so pretty and it says Hello NY. This book retails for $18.95 and it's at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So I got some books that I can read. Let's see. Here is a little chalkboard easel. Okay, these were on my list for a little DIY and they are just these little white candles. And then this one, Ugh, I saw this one when she FaceTimed me and it looked so pretty. And it actually smells really good. This one is bergamot ginger. Oh, it smells so good. I thought the little jar, which is absolutely darling. So, so stinking cute. Okay, so I had a few baby items on my list. One of them is a repeat purchase. So one of the accounts was showing how they had these little bandana bibs. So I think this one's so cute. It is a very light purple with white polka dots. I thought that was just adorable. And then this little blanket was on my list. I already have one, or do I have two? One or two. It's so cute. It's this little buffalo check blanket. It's adorable. And then while she was there, she saw these. So I thought this one was cute for the baby. And I was thinking about using this one in Max's little doggy bed. So these were really cute. Next up, we have some eyeglass pouches. The prints were just so adorable and they have a ton of different prints. Meg showed me so many, but these are the two that I went with, the little cactus print. And then these are for the foodie. You have ice cream, popsicles, watermelon, drinks. This is adorable. Okay, some little crafting items. We have these little wood pieces here and they are circular. And then I got a few of these little crates here. These little crates are so cute. These, oh my goodness, I am so obsessed with these. I think they are absolutely perfect just the way they are. I may DIY one of them, but they're so cute. So this one is like a whitewash and it says home. And then this one has a heart and it says love. And then this one says gather. These are so stinking cute. These look like they come from Hobby Lobby. Okay, next up we have some reindeer moss, two bags of that, a cute little kitchen cloth, dishcloth, kitchen towel. Okay, this was on my list for the baby. This is a LED projector light, and I saw on someone's story they tried it out, and it like projects, I believe, like stars. Yeah, it projected like stars up on their ceiling, and the baby's like little sound machine is also a projector, and she absolutely loves it, so I thought. This would be really fun to try with her. So really excited about this. Okay, next up we have these little like jars. They're actually like cups, but they have a lid. These would be perfect for overnight oats. So she picked me up, I think three or four of these and then a lot more and then a lot of crafting supplies. Like all of this stuff 
I want to do DIYs with. So we have some more woodwork glue, tacky glue, as well as we've already had to repurchase this adhesive spray. Absolutely love it. Um, we have some chunky brushes, some furniture scratch markers. And then these two items are like frames, but they're mirrors. So I thought these would be really cool for decor. The Crafter Square has this like, um, what is it called? Adhesive cork sheet. So I thought this was pretty cool. Uh, what do we have? Oh, we have a little tray of the Jenga pieces. She also picked me up a few of these crates and then the little tumbling Jenga wood pieces. Um, let's see. These next items are like little bird houses. So she picked me up a couple of each one. I thought that they would be A, fun to make the little bird houses and decorate them and paint them. And then I thought um, with the other set, maybe I could like use the wood pieces in like future DIYs. So that is that. And then these like tiny little glass jars. I thought I could store some of my beads in here. They are mini glass containers and you get a four piece. Okay, and the last few items that she bought are these little blocks or like little cubes. So all of the sides are solid except for one and it's like a little drawer. Uh-oh, this way. It's a little drawer. I thought that these would be cute to paint and um, maybe for like Olivia's room. So she got me a few of these. They're really cute. Um, I think that the boxes have like different shapes on them so these have flowers i think all the ones that she bought me have flowers but maybe at the store they may have like hearts and stars i'm not really sure Alrighty, guys that is a wrap for this video i tried to get through it as fast as possible if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe if you are not already subscribed hit that notification bell so you won't miss my next upload and i'll see you in my next one bye guys Want you close Maybe hold your hand a little while Somehow I know You're gonna be the girl that I'll end up Calling my own